spark. It's good to see you ready to travel the universe. All of these worlds made by others just like you. So much to explore. So much to create. The universe is waiting for you to bring it to life. The stories yet to be told, the games to be made, civilizations and societies to be formed. So, what kind of spark are you? Player, creator, or both? Oh, but whatever you choose, there's a universe of possibilities. Now, how do we begin? Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippie Tesla, and welcome to Conquer's Big Reunion, the sequel that was never to be. Uh, it was made for Microsoft's Project Spark game. That's a video game creator. It was so good and so badass, but uh, it was ab abandoned too soon. I played the beta, uh, I and for like two years maybe and then in 2015 they finally released the full thing alongside they released uh, a conquer sequel made in project spark it was supposed to have several episodes but only one was released and uh, it was a paid dlc but after a while they just released everything for free for project spark and washed their hands clean off it so the let's just briefly touch on Project Spark, as I said it was a game creation game, let me just see if this is as it should be, yes, yes, okay, so you could create your own uh, thing, like world, game, a movie, whatever, it, it was brimming with possibilities, and this is like the first <laughs> version before they, I don't think it had like maybe two updates before they abandoned it, and uh, it was on Windows 8 and then 10 and also on Xbox One but Xbox One was better because you could create and play with your friends well you couldn't do that on Windows they still didn't figure that out Xbox on Windows was still young uh, you had the tutorial which, where this like narrator guy would explain everything they did change his voice from beta to the full release which is sad uh, you could start from an empty world and do whatever you want, or to, like guided uh, creation. And this is something I've been working on, an island. Don't ask. Maybe someday you'll find out. But let's get into Conquer. So there were community games. It's all down now, but there were like thousands of games here that people made remakes of popular games, stuff like that, all made in this game making game engine. <laughs> Uh, there was also the crossroads mode where you create a game and you make choices as you create it. It's kind of like RPG-ish. So you would make your own hero, you would shape the world, all that, while playing the game. And then you can save it and share it with your friends so they can play it too. It was out of this world. But what we're interested in is episodic adventures. And there was Void Storm, which never got a sequel. And then there's Conquer's Big Reunion. It's been 10 long years since Conquer the Squirrel was crown king of the land, of all the land. To celebrate, Conquer is hosting a big reunion at his favorite watering hole, the Cock and Plucker. Of course, Conquer's already been um, celebrating. <laughs> I love that. So he's going to need your help uh, getting to the party. So, yeah, let's get into it. And it's not pretty long, because like I said, just one episode of what it could have been. But still, that's the closest thing to uh, to conquer conquer's bed for a day we ever got. Chris Seaver returns, reprises his roles as conquer and everyone else, of course. And I only played the first level. I was like, I need to stream this. This is why it's it's tagged as first playthrough because basically it is. Man, the times have changed since Bad Fur Day. Zero players playing. That's so sad. It can't count. Even if someone's playing it, you know, 
because the Project Spark servers are down, we'll never be able to see that, unfortunately. Well, here I am, ten years later, and there's a reunion. Who'd Let me see the so audio. Time will go by without another adventure. To celebrate? Look, I celebrated. Well, a little too much, I guess. I hope I'm wrong, but this has all the making of another bad fur day. Here, boost boosted the volume, because Conquer is quieter than the rest of the game. It's a little glitchy. No, no, Bertie. <laughs> I remember. I scared Bertie. <laughs> Bertie, right, yeah. So, uh, what's all this racket about anyway? <laughs> the union. The caca -ca No late. Oh, no. How can I forget? <laughs> Those poor squirrels. Bertie, I really need your help. I'm in no condition to get there on my own. I can't miss this. Oh, my head. Uh, you need a little tick. Hey, well, it is cold in here. Hey, who are you to judge anyway? <laughs> no, no, no. I think so. <laughs> Contact sensitive. Remember? Oh, I think Gotta love that sound. shallow thing. Yeah, yeah. It's sensitive to context or something like that. I haven't used one of those in years. <laughs> Try it now. <laughs> Look at the squirrels. <laughs> oh, the censored squirrel wee wee. Let's go there. Oh, how did that get in there? Great that I'm dressed and all, but I still feel a little bit sick. Oh, I gotta get used to the uh, normal controls. You gonna help me, boy? Can't do anything. So let's just follow the path for now. You could make things like this in Project Spark. And it wasn't that hard. You didn't have to be a programmer or anything. It was like, what you see is what you get kind of programming. With some... Uh, just add some logic into it. Ah, oh, that feels better. Okay. Where's the music? Oh, the bridge is busted. I can't seem to get any further. Hmm. I'm sure there's something. Oh, yeah. Oh, now I remember. Press A to jump, and then A again to do that funny helicopter tail thing. Now that makes me hopper. Hmm. I should easily be able to get across that gap. Although, it feels like I'm forgetting something. Something about crouching. Hmm. I must have somehow, I must have somehow lost that animation. Well, anyway, um, I he can't crouch him. Well, it was made in Project Spark. They did their best. I, I assume that if they continued the development of Project Spark, it would have been improved, but too bad. I don't know what Team Dakota is up to now. A lot gay. Pulling out all the tropes already, I see. <clears throat> the pan is a lot easier to use. I got the key. It actually makes a lot more sense like this. Though, you can see that it's Project Spark. There is no save, so we gotta complete the entire game, entire game, in one sitting. Which, I think, won't be such a problem. Ah, the good old cock and pluck. Almost there. Can't wait to see everyone. Music! Do 
There's nothing on the signposts. You're the king of all the land. Microtransactions. Huh? Micro what? This must be new. What happened to just paying up front? No, no, no. Look around. Money everywhere. Just fine. Oh, well, I guess I'll just have to earn cash the old fashioned way. I wonder how they did these custom animations. Hey, what are you guys doing here? It's the teddies. Uh, now I'm down one hundred dollars. I need to look around for some opportunities to make some more cash and get some payback. Oh, they took one piece of chocolate. There's the cock and plucker. Can't get in. They made the sign and everything. Oh, nice. This would be a good thumbnail if I can just get the. Ah. Cool. Can I get drunk? No. That's an infinitely leaking barrel. But the sound is really low at times. Can I swim? Yep. But you can't crouch. So I need 300 bucks to pay the tab. Can I climb the roof? Yep. The fall damage is a lot nicer. So we should have like three routes to go to now. Let's start from the left, I guess. The leftiest. Follow that teddy. Oh. like the graphics of Project Spark. It was really good for 2013 when the beta was released. Teddy's cutting logs. See? Oh, it's way too easy to make a poo joke here. <laughs> no, no, no. Cutting trees for wood. Building bigger base. Da, cash, dash, da. Oh, actually cutting logs. Right. <laughs> Oh, is this gonna be the Metal Gear Solid sequence? Maybe? I think so. Oops. What does the guy have to do to get an actual carpal boxer around here? Now I'm Solid Snake. Zombie would be proud. So not obvious, huh? Come in, conquer. Come in, conquer. That's as bad as Oh my god. Uh, what? Where are you? How am I hearing you? Uh, implanted Kamu 
Come on, Kate, don't dip out. Sounds high tech. I, I don't have a headset on. Where's the implant? <laughs> don't ask. <laughs> <sighs> Security too high. I, I, I'm gonna need to sneak in. Uh, yeah, I'm working on it. Watch their movements. Go, friend, say. Yeah, I got that. Mm. Hey, uh, how come they don't hear us talking? They catch you. <laughs> Legit questions there. Uh, I'm no hero, okay? I'm just trying to pay my tax. <laughs> you almost got me back. <laughs> Are they stuck? Look at them. Why are they spinning like that? Oh god. Don't cross the streams. Ha <laughs> ha. Ha, mine is bigger. Okay, okay, good to know. So do I need to cross the big log with my barrel thingy? No, don't come this way. Oh shit. Seriously, I agree with him. So that guy is going to be in my way, good to know. Come in, conquer. Come in, conquer. Wonder if I can go this way. Uh, what? Where are you? How am I hearing you? Uh, implanted communication device. Uh, sounds high tech. I, I don't have a headset on. Where is the implant? <laughs> Ah, uh, don't ask. <sighs> Security too high. Can you watch out for that guy? Uh, yeah, I'm working on it. Watch the movements. Go and say. Yeah, I got that. Hey, uh, no, 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 no. They don't hear us talking. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Uh, I'm no hero, okay? I'm just trying to pay my tax. Oh, what's going on? Is, am I not supposed to go there? Because it kind of looks like I'm supposed to go there. Oh, there we go. All right. Maybe I should have gone for that chocolate, but I didn't want to get, get in their way. Okay, so far so good. Let's keep an eye on that asshole. Where are you going, dude? Okay, he's going in circles. That's good for me. This is pretty fucked up. Turn around, like a good boy. Yeah. All right. Fucking more tense than Metal Gear. Oh Jesus, there's a lot of them there. What is going on there? They're roasting something, I think. 
Looks like the meal's back on the menu, boys. Meat. The meat. Are they roasting squirrels? I hope not. Because that's grim. Come on. Pick a route. Turn your back. That's right. It's good. At least they're generous. They always turn their backs after they're, uh, they notice you. Where to now, for fuck's sake? Over there, I assume, because I see chocolate. There's nothing here. Turn around. Yep. Thank you. Oh wow, there's three of them patrolling that tree. So the best I can do is go behind one of them. Like right behind one of them. Cool. There you go. Okay. What the hell is that? Oh, this is, gonna be a mess. is that an RE4 reference? Oh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, damn it. <laughs> oh, what the fuck do I do? Am I playing Dead by Daylight? He's stuck in poop. Oh, wow. Okay, we gotta get him into shit. Oh wait, there's something here. This isn't gonna be one of those quick times, is it? Oh jeez. Oh wow. I got a chainsaw? Nice. I'm glad I picked this route first. When I tested the game I picked the other route. You'll see. That's my weapon now? Okay. I always wondered why he never got the the chainsaw in Bad Fur Day, considering that like on the N64 it starts with him chainsawing the N64 logo in half. <laughs> hey, over here. So, you want some of the green stuff, eh? Oh, cash prizes. So, you want some of the green stuff, eh? So we got a hundred bucks. Our first hundred. Wait, where do I go now? There should be an exit somewhere, I think. Or maybe I'm not supposed to be here. Maybe over here? Oh no, over here. It's obvious. <laughs> Where am I now? Oh, back at the start, I guess. Okay. Oh, Jesus, it scared me. Whose house? Outhouse. Let me see. No, oh, I'll just show the unlocked ones. So yeah, this one, I think, is next. Oh, nuts. You'll see why. <laughs> so Conquer had its had its own... Uh, Conquer's Big Reunion had its own achievements in the... Um, <laughs> in Project Spark. Aside from the main game, right? That's where we went first, right? Yeah. 
Okay, the next one is this. I think this is going to be the one I tested the game with. When I decided this has to be streamed. Yeah. Brewery. Now that's my kind of place. The cash is locked away, but you can get it. Of course I can get it. I'm well, conquer. I'm off them. Oh, that's not the one I tested it with. Someone should really keep an eye out the door. This one's drunk. Oh, I don't have the chainsaw anymore. Okay, they die in the classic Project Spark way. So are they all drunk? Come on, you have you bet. Oh. Too bad you don't keep the chainsaw. Kill all the teddies. Teddy, I hate So it's not dead? Oh my god, are we gonna do the Donkey Kong thing? Yeah, nothing I can do here. Maybe I boost the volume a bit more, huh? Let me see what the meter says. Oh, it's not that bad. It's like a new rendition of Windy Theme. Okay, so there's di absolutely nothing here. I guess we just gotta cross this bear. Oh, I getcha. Oh, I getcha. Charge! Okay, now to the other one. They did the best they could with Project Spark. I mean, well, in its condition at the time. We even have the, like, focus the blurs when things are out of focus. <laughs> oh, you witty, aren't you? All right. Now I guess cross the, the stream of beers. Oh, can move the camera? So there's nothing here. Oh, a fast platforming section. And the frame rate goes to shit. I guess this way. Fuck you, teddies. So now on this one. That's pretty cool how they use the assets. Because I recognize these assets, you can use them in the game. Z. Oh, is that beer? Oh no, all this delicious brew going to waste. <laughs> I agree with you, it's such a waste. That guy died happy. 
So, more platforming. Am I gonna get drunk from that stream? Ah! Oh, fuck! Oh, you don't die, you just kinda get drunk? Nope, not even that. Just enjoy swimming in beer, why not? So I gotta jump on the other one before I get hit by the beer stream. Okay, good to know. Okay, same here. Oh, come on. Okay. <laughs> it is Conqueror, all right. The master of trolling. Blah. Blah. So how do I do that without getting fucked by that? Oop. So it's not that. What am I missing here? Do I need to push a button or something? Maybe I need to push something to stop the beer. Let's check back here. Ah. Don't fall out though. Let's try it again. Wee! Yep. Nope. I'll try again. I'm pretty sure you need to jump on that thing over there. Wait, maybe I can look up now? Yeah, I must jump on that thing. Like the only alcohol there is. They sink though. There we go. That was a hard ass jump. Oh, wow. So that's how we're going to do it. kegs here oh god what hit the spot oh god why did I do this again what was the point I don't even know I did this or oh, maybe I, I'm gonna be heavier and not pushable while I'm drunk just theory a game theory. Yeah, everything's slower. That's not how drunken people work. Oh. What's over here, though? Can't go there. Bleh. Oh, this effect is making me drunk. Okay, the lower ones I don't care for. But the 
the top ones are scary. Uh, aspirin time. <laughs> okay, that's the second hundred bucks. Whoa, there's so many over here. Ha, working towards my fortune. Good thing I didn't have to code this thing myself. So that's a reference to uh, how Project Spark works when you have to code things in and uh, so may, you know create triggers. If this happens, then this happens. And yeah, what I forgot to mention, Project Spark is kind of the sequel or spiritual successor to Microsoft's previous game building uh, thingy called Codu Lab. So that, that's where the coding with the K comes comes from, I believe. I tried Code Lab, but it, it's not nearly as good as Project Spark. Yeah. Fair enough. And we're back at the start. Awesome. So there was the second one, and the third one is going to be, well, the final one. That's the third level, but before we go in there, we're going to explore a bit. We're going to have to take a two minute break here, in two minutes, because <laughs> my IP is about to switch. Yeah, don't get stuck. There's no saving here. I don't want to do all that again. There's nothing here. 1558, okay. This is going to be one of the shortest streams I ever had. Let's look at Conqueror. In the meantime, I wish I could see the model closer. Can you... Can bring the camera closer. Triggers do nothing. Bumpers open the health. Money bar. Sticks don't do nothing. Don't do nothing. <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that. But you can see the Project Spark skies. Oh, there we go. Late achievement. Fajo money? Fajo money? What the fuck does that even mean? Another one. Italian plumber. 0.09%. These are some really rare achievements. Alright folks, we'll take a two, two to five, let's say, minute break here. Just wait for the IP to switch. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back with the final section of Conker's Big Reunion. Here we go. Alright. As far as I know, this will be the final section of the game. Very, very short game. Yeah, that's the one I've been to. With the achievement. Oh, nuts! So you're saying I should leave? Okay. No, no, no. You uh, wouldn't happen to have a rocket launcher or something then? Because <laughs> that would help. That helped last time. Context, Sensati. Oh, I see. Okay. Bye bye then. Yep, that's it. This is going to be a shooty section. How the game was never optimized. I mean, Project Spark was never fully optimized. Oh God, I, I know the sky. You can pick the sky. And the rain and everything. 
Okay, time to shoot some teddies. Let's get a good position. I know this one because this is the only section I played. Oh, I'm gonna need a bigger gun. Oh god, what? Whoa. Oh, inverse. Why? Okay. Keep an eye left and right. It's that. It's that soundtrack. I like how you can use the machine gun separately. Are they cloning teddies in here or something? Come here. Fuck yeah. Uh, hello, designers. I, I know you just tried to pass the playtime in here, but can we get on with this already? I agree, actually. Though this is fun, playing a first person sequence in Project Spark. Oh shit. Oh shit, help. Oh, they can shoot. Get the upper one. Don't die. done oh wow with one health jeez okay do I still have one health but he doesn't get tired like in the original so there's some anti-gravity chocolate hold on key I'll get right on to you is that a full health almost good enough if I do this right, this is the hardest boss actually that I um, that I've been to. Crazy, crazy! Come on, chat. There we go. <laughs> of course, there has to be some balls because it's conquered. Oh, he's angry, and I don't like him. <laughs> Fuck, that always gets me. Okay, he's gonna finish me. Most certainly. There we go. Run for him. <laughs> no, 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 no. Get the chocolate and run. No, I want him, want him to throw the grenades because that's not going to hurt me as much as the laser. So glad I tried this section before so I don't have to torture myself here. Ah, oh, fuck. Woo! <laughs> the tears. <laughs> the tears. This is actually challenging. There's the last one. Woo! Okay. Okay, with that we won, definitely. 
It's not nearly as challenging as the OG Conquer, definitely. Achoo! That's a lot of nuts. Oh, somebody come get me! I'm coming, little cash fellow. So straight over there. Not much to see here. I tried to see if there's anything. It's well designed, but underused. That's the 300 bucks. We're gonna get the money wet. Now I can pay off my tap and join the reading. Or not. Those bastards! I'm gonna need to douse those fuses. So we're gonna have a pissing section, of course. <laughs> RT is whiz. Oh no! Over where they're burning. Oh gee. Oh fuck, I fucked that up. Okay. The animations are just silly. Is it done? Yep. No. No, I failed. I failed the cock and plucker. A massive fortune. Ah, oh, that's a little late, but okay. Does, uh, does this game have continues? <laughs> does this game have continues? Okay. How could they? Okay, quickly. So douse the fuses. That one's done. Time to reload. Okay, one more. One more. We can do this. So close. Quicker. Oh, fuck. Did I go from the wrong side? Oh, fuck. Not again. I gotta do something quick. Fuck, okay, don't touch him. I guess piss on him as well. <laughs> Come here, let me piss on you. I'm your friend. More, 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 more quickly. It's not nearly as gracious as the original Conquer, but okay. Did I do it? I 
that time this happened, <laughs> I wasn't even on fire. <laughs> you said that. Well, I got the money I need to pay off my tap. Time for the read. And to run up a new tap to celebrate. 300 bucks is a lot of drinks. Like even in, you know, US or UK prices. Tired of your antics. The stunts you've pulled on us are unforgivable. It was the last straw. We're having our own reunion without you. And we're not telling you what. So pardon my bluntness, but bugger off. Your ex friends. Your ex friends. Yeah. This is not a ransom note. And you're not captured. Oh. So it's a ransom note. I will never find out what happened. What? No one came for the reunion? And the cock and plucker closed early? Oh, everyone's mad at me and I can't remember why. What did I do? Alright, let's get going. That's it, I think. Yep. And that's the last we've seen of Conquer. Never continued. In the meantime, how about making some of your own stories and adventures? Or playing some made by others? That's it, folks, I guess. It was fine. It wasn't anything genius, but it was so lovely to see Conquer and Birdie and hear Chris Seaver talk to himself. But yeah, that's it. Very short. The shortest stream we've had, I think. Not counting the first ones. Here, for reference, what I could do is... I'm gonna briefly show how Project Start Spark worked. So let's start... from scratch. Create a new world. And just so you get an idea how this was made. So you have, let me just remember, that's, oh, undo, undo, what was the, oh yeah, that, and holding LB, and then that's scale, yeah, 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 that's zoom, okay, holding RB, camera mode, then you can make the Let's say the area, bigger or smaller. You can make your own textures even, but let's use some preset ones. Let's say this one. And then you just go and populate it. You can also use, like, we can use whole biomes, I think. Yeah. They're all open now. Castle wall, for instance. Where did I put it? There? Okay. No, not biome. Uh, I wanted... Was it paint, I think? Yeah. I gotta stop pressing A. Castle wall. But you can also use, like... I forgot the control, so I'm getting into this. It's been a while. Press A, and then use, like... You can make... Oh, there was a whole town. Let's say nature biome. So, like, if you don't want to detail it too much, you can... Stop pressing A, it's trigger. Fuck damn it. That's not what I want. Apply biome. Erase biome. Okay. Let's see what was it. But can't go to free slots? What the hell? Undo everything. Let's do a river. Okay, that makes sense. That's what I expect to see. Get it out to sea. Then let's say nature now. That's what I wanted to see. Whoosh, whoosh. So people compare this a lot to Minecraft. Yeah, I just finished it 
then I just finished it. I'm just showing the tool which it was made in. Uh, Chris Seaver played Conquer and all that. It's a very short game, man. It's okay. I mean, it's good. Like I said, it's good to see Chris Seaver do his thing. But, uh, like, it was made in Project Spark, so... <laughs> yeah. It was made in Project Spark, so... I'm just showing off how it was made. But I just finished Conquer. It's like less than an hour. It's supposed to have like five episodes, but the entire Project Spark was cancelled before they managed to pull out the second episode. So this is just me fucking around in Project Spark. Actually, I'm gonna do a Project Spark stream, actual Project Spark creation. It's a game creation game. It was pretty cool, but since it's Microsoft, at the first sight of losing money, they're like, whoops, nope, cancelled. Cancelled. We're cancelling everything. But you could really fuck around with this. You could program characters. I was gonna say people um, people com compared it to ooh boggy swamp. There are some that I've never seen in. Oh cool! Stop that! Stop that! I want to see boggy swamp. Shit, that was awesome. A lot. I haven't seen a lot of these things on the PC. Hey senpai. You guys just came in a bit too late. Well, not too late to see Project Spark in action, but definitely late for Conquer. Like I said, it was just like the whole game was 40 minutes. At least that first part. It was supposed to have more, but the whole thing was cancelled. How did I pick the biomes? That's right. Let's see, Windy Grassland. Oh god, Xbox had way more stuff than the PC. So let's say... Uh, oh, like that, and then... Whoop! Pretty badass. Wait, if I change, aha! Uh -huh, I have to change. Put it. Put it in a slot. So let's see. Arctic glaciers. Wow! Cool. 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 So we had that, like the free creation mode. We're gonna exit without saving. We just finished Conquer, <laughs> like I said, Conquer's big reunion. There was also, so that was supposed to have a few episodes. Uh, there was Void Storm that was supposed to have a few episodes also cancelled, like the entire Project Spark. But another thing I want to show before I end this stream is Crossroads, where you create a game and play at the same time. That was ingenious. I, I, I really wish they would bring this concept back. It was so short-lived. Even if it had a chance, now they killed it. No, no, it will need to begin. The volume is Mountain okay. Peaks. So you choose... Choose your world, kind of. So let's say... I always liked mountains. Ooh, rushing rivers. Oh yeah, there's Canyons. more. Canyons. Lovely hills. Winding rivers. Let's say mountains. mountains. You can choose the water height, the mountain height, valley height, terrain roughness. Let's make it more rough. Just don't look down. <laughs> Morning, Terra. How are you? Ah, Spark. What a picture you paint. A desert? Oh, I forgot. I I spent my entire 2014 to 2016 in this game. A magical land. And I, I think I cried when they canceled it. it you could see real and, man and tears. Everyone could create a good, like a really good game in this. So sorry to hear that, Terra. Is it at least better than yesterday? A new land? Windy Grasslands? Is there like... Forest? Forest. I always like the forest. So the forest biome is what Conquer was created in. So let's, let's say Windy. That's, that's a new one for me. Beautiful land? I always liked how it builds the world. Water heights, shore material, peak material, nature density. Oh, cool. Let's make it more dense. What's a Chaimid? I've never seen a place like this before. Have you ever been outside, man? What's going on in your world? Let's say night. Aside the rising of the sun, a storm brewing on the horizon, a gray and grisly day. 
A sunny midday for all a nebulous nebula. Whoa. Stars as far as the eye can see. Oh, that's really cool. The departure of the sun? Let's choose this one, Donkey Kong. Humidifier. Painting it's okay. Do it Don't sweat it. So this is like a bonus. Do I'm just doing this as a bonus. My, what a wonderful world. Damn, Project Spark ran on Xbox way better than on PC, I gotta say. What is asked of your hero? The only is mode they finished happened? was the adventure mode. Could it be stolen? We're gonna Time put the village. To your claim. So you can literally pick where you wanna start. Let's choose this. Looks like a good area for a village. What does the village hold most dear? Royal statue. A festival of merit. A special Town space. Shrine. Well, for wishing. Sacred tree. On a limb with this sacred tree. Yes. What mysteries does this tree hold? Well, kinda, yeah. Every story needs a hero, and ours come in the form of champions. Each champion has their own set of unique powers that can be leveled up. That means we have Conqueror as a champion, probably. A spell slinging sorcerer. Wait, what? A goblin? A knight of the realm? The fame and mysterious. There's Conqueror. Let's make Conqueror a hero, because we did this as <laughs> a shape-shifting druid. Conquer the squirrel. Yes. Okay. Why not? <laughs> Looks like we're all in for a bad fur day. So yeah, we're gonna make our own so conquer game as a, as a sequel. Oh my god, I miss this music. I love this game, guys. And your bee friends, stay away from my plans. They do not need pollinating. <laughs> Okay, this wasn't on PC, at least not in Serbia, because it was blocked due to censored content. Sacred Tree is our most precious resource. It's rumored to be rooted directly into the Wellspring. Would you like to see it? The Wellspring is Project Sparks, like, well of creation, let's say. Oh no, assailants are upon us. And me without my shovel, <laughs> they're after the tree. What danger threatens your village? Ooh, void goblins? A brazen band of bandits? Void corrupted goblins? You mean... You mean like... Project Spark needs to... Teddies. Revive? Teddies, yeah, let's make it fully void conquer. Beans? So like I the said, I finished the... Um, the actual oh, Conquer's man. reunion. Oh, zombies, nice. B Conquer's Big Reunion, so I just wanted to show off Project Spark, but I never played this. <laughs> but I never played, like, uh, Crossroads mode, create and play your game on Xbox, where you have all, all the content, so I'm pretty much... Wa wow, I didn't expect this. Sure, plus this. Like, I played the shit out of this, but never, never with this content. There is a way to install it on Windows 8 through 11, but it's not gonna work if you never had it on your account. Well, I had it in, in my account and it's still, because Microsoft fully pulled it out, you can't download it anywhere, but somehow, as if I predicted it, I, uh, I kept it on the Xbox, so it's still playable. I believe that like finding an Xbox with this installed would be fucking expensive. Okay. Uh, oh, you can focus on the thing. Okay, and you can tap to show the objective. The gardener will know what to do. Cool! You can make as many Conquer games as you want, actually. Probably better than, the, than Conquer's Big Reunion, though no Chris Seaver's voice in this mode, I assume. Oh, our sacred tree, those studies have made a grisly mess of it. <laughs> you can edit the text, as you can see in the upper right, you can like, you can change everything. 
I can make a cleansing antidote, but I'm missing the key component. What is your hero searching for? I mean, it's a tree. Of course, it's gonna be an apple. Apple. The swiped scepter, a valued elixir. I just want to see what else. Do. Meat? A mystery meat. A, sh a strong tonic. A suspiciously shiny apple. So not many. I believe there was there were more things on the It'll PC, but it's like cider. it's been five years. Thank the wellspring. It, its roots still live. We can restore the rest with a fertilizer or crust, off crust, crushed magic apple. Unfortunately, our attackers also looted our storage and took the magic apple. The barbarians who took it must be allied with the teddies. They were teddies. They probably brought it to back to their main camp at the. Now you pick where. Pure imagination awaits your hero. Uh, where? Druid Grove. Any Cody and ruins among mysterious druids. Oh, graveyard sounds fun. Village consumed by fire. A mighty castle. Knocking won't get you into this fort. A terrifying tower. Corrupted tower, maybe. A quarry. Quarry. An ancient druid. The ruins of ancient Cody. So I don't know. I'm. I'm. I'm looking towards the corrupted tower. tower. Yes, why not? That looks like a teddy thing. Where in the world will you be? This is pretty okay. I mean, it's as if it was made for it. Wherever you put it, it's gonna rearrange the whole structure of the map to accommodate. So let's it's put it. It's teeming with evil energy. Now you can create the path yourself, path for your adventure. or press A to have it automatically created. So. Just like zigzag something. Well, now that you're finished, you can start. <laughs> That's a good one. That one always made me laugh. Now that you're finished, you can start. How is the tree burning? They will have it in their hideout back at the corrupted tower. Please save our tree. It sustains us all. Poor tree. Okay, return the magic apple to the village. Now everything that's blue, it's for you to like assign. What would I like here? The first what thing we begins, want. What will be built here? A rowdy tavern. Yes. Good times and good stories. Sugar overload. I remember the NPCs. Oh my god, how memory is a funny thing. It's like I played this yesterday. Also, you level up your heroes every time you do. Uh, um, a crossroads. Now I see that it didn't. I think it didn't transfer my project over from Windows 8 or 10 uh, because my goblin, I played the goblin most and he was like level 20 something. But every time you play anything in crossroads, even when you play games other people created while that still worked, you will level up your character. What vision? What do you envision here? An eye in the sky. Is this place what you were looking for? Oh, cool. A humble pawn shop? A giant windmill? Yeah, let's go with the... Oh, wait. A store bursting with goods? So depending on what you put, your side windmill? quests will change. Let's say windmill. This windmill looks like a giant. Okay, and finally we'll put the arsenal here. This looks like a perfect spot for what? A sweet little hut? The local law enforcement? Oh yeah, the side quest with the prisoner. Legendary Is this arsenal. I think because you can upgrade stuff with it. Actually no, I'm gonna go with something. A workable workshop. A bakery? Do you want to know your future? A reputable pawn shop? A reputable pawn shop. <laughs> A guard tower? Yeah, that sounds good. Now they won't catch you off guard. Hello. What's this? An encounter, but of which kind? Okay. A farmer with a farm to find? A forgotten sword in a deserted grove? 
An ancient hedge of stone? A training camp bustling with eager recruits? Holy shit, there's a lot more events than a I remember. A mysterious observatory? A critter rancher? <laughs> That's... That was like the rabbit squirrels or something. An axe with power over the undead? A knight's tournament? Calling home. Another worldly adventure? Calling home doesn't have a forgotten sword in a deserted grove. You know what? I want to see close a encounter. Close encounter. That one I didn't have on Where the PC. Where will this crash have landed? Let's put it. I mean, it would make sense to be. Where's the village? That's where I end. So let's put it somewhere. Like here. This looks like a good sp spot. How close is too close? Greetings, I am Lagerta, a traveling huntress. Last night I saw a huge fiery meteor crash not far from this. If that, like the object of that size crashed, you'd be pretty fucked. <laughs> if you're heading that way, you should make sure whatever fell from the sky is not a threat. Good luck and good hunting. So that's another side quest. Let's see what this person has. You there. What new diversion is this? Let's say. Hmm. A let's, rancher? let's put this I one. I suggest you place this somewhere downwind. <laughs> Man, I like their sense of humor. It smells a bit like fur and flour. It's not a critter ranch without critters, but what kind? Foxes. A skulk of foxes? Going down the rabbit hole? A scurry of squirrels? Yeah, squirrels. This We're conquered. This place has always been a bit squirrely. Well met, stranger. People call me the Colonel. You look like the discerning type. The kind who opens the door to opportunity when it knocks. Let me tell you about once in a lifetime. Holy fucking shit. Oh, get away. Ouch. Sorry about that. The crit that critter rancher has it out for me. I can't do anything without being attacked by those blasted things. I'm just a humble salesman and he she's ruining my business. I have a proposition for you. I can't even get close to that ranch, but if you talk some sense into her, I'd make it worth your while. What do you say? Great. I have a feeling this is the start of a lucrative partnership. Alright. Sugar overload. Did I just eat something? Who's attacking? Holy... What's with the sound now? It's okay. Uh, are you okay? What the hell? Ten matches in the Spark Treasure Troll game were collect. Okay. Ah, because of the coins. Do I look like okay to you? Do I look okay to you? I drank too much root beer and now I feel horrible. Is there anything I can do to help? You wouldn't happen to have any dogs leave, would ya? Dogs leave? What's that? It's the best cure for a sugar-induced headache. If you bring me some dog's leaf, I'll make it worth your while. It grows along the road and has purple flowers. You can't miss it. So how many quests do I have? What's this? Oh, that's money. Cool. Yeah, near the end, when they decided to cancel the game, uh, to kill it off, uh, they made all the achievements that you'd have to work for hard, they made them a lot easier. So instead of doing, you know, like, all the shit that you can do, like play other people's games... But are you fucking kidding me? He's still alive. Didn't even notice that guy. But I'm also not leveling up, that's weird. Follow the coins, that's our road.
But remember, you should have something by holding the button. Let me try. This way to the corrupted tower. Okay. It's B though. B is like, wow! Okay. Why is... Oh, fuck! I have a machine gun. Cool. Nope. What happened? Oh, because I held LB. Okay, don't hold LB. No! Cool! He can swap weapons. Nice. But I'm still not leveling up. Maybe once I finish, actually. It's kind of auto-aiming, so... Yep. There's the flower she needs. Yeah, it is. Let's go back. How did I change weapon? Why? Ow! You fucker! So you're kind of making a game and playing it at the same time. That was, that was out of this world. And then you can go to your friends and be like, Lou, look what I made! Hey, who's that flying fella? Probably another side quest. Where's the tavern? It's more content loaded than the actual Conqueror's Big Reunion. It's crazy. Sugar Overload. You found some dog leaf? Here's 10 coins for your trouble. Alright, I kept my end of the bargain hand over that dog's leaf. A deal's a deal, here you go. Thanks, I feel better already. Now I can drink more root beer. Of course. <laughs> Why the fuck not? Ooh, I want the meat too. Find out what fell, fell from the sky, okay. Content sensitive gags. Perform a random attack gag for a limited time. Dodge. Jump. Press again in midair to double jump. Okay. Okay, so it depends on where you are. Okay. Cool, so Conquer has unique powers in this. I had no idea. I came in here just to do the, uh, the big reunion and I could have... Is that Tingle? That's fucking Tingle or parody of Tingle. I came to do the big reunion and I didn't expect any of this. Match game 25. Make 25 matches in the Spark Treasure Troll game or collect 25 coins. Yeah, they really made some of these easy. Just so people wouldn't rage about, you know, unachievable achievements. Oh! Oh, did they do it? Did that do it? Yep. So, I played the beta from 2014 to 20. 15 when it was released what now and I, I had so much fun with this game then they released it in 2015 and just uh, maybe three four months later they were like we're canceling conquer it's not well, not conquer project spark it's not feasible they already released conquer's big reunion the thing I played first in the stream and uh, And then, because that happened, a lot of people paid a lot of money. They were like, we're making everything in Project Spark free. Uh, all the DLC, and they, they refunded everybody who bought Project Spark. So, yeah. But like I said, I only played it on Windows 10, or Windows 8, then 10. Why did I take this guy down? Like, was there a purpose to this? I guess I already... Because there's a limited number of quests you can get. Oh. So I might ha have hit the quest cap. 
Because at any point you can go to edit and just keep edit and program the game yourself. Whatever you're doing. So let's let's see this through to the end. I almost ended the stream with Conquer's Big Reunion. I had no idea this is here. But I'm glad I wanted uh, to take another peek. Fuck up, fuck up, fuck up, fuck up, fuck up. Oh no! They have gas grenades now? Jesus. The actual Conquer's Big Reunion has voice acting by Chris uh, Seaver. I, I keep wanting to say Chris Farlow. <laughs> And um, he replaces his role as Conquer, Birdie, uh, the Teddies, the Money even. And it, it just had three quests in the first episode. So if you want to check that, check out the VOD. You'll see what I did there. Like I finished the game in 40 minutes. There was a Metal Gear Solid section. Where you go and s you hide in a barrel and sneak around Teddies. There was a... What was the second one? I just played it. There was a brewery section that parodied uh, Donkey Kong... The first Donkey Kong with the barrels and everything. And then there was the Teddy's Factory section, which I guess was supposed to be... I don't know what that was supposed to be. But the achievements will tell us. Yeah, it's not uh, play anywhere because the achievements didn't come over from... Uh, from the Windows version urination and finally we had to save cock and pluckers so all nuts was the Teddy's abomination boss look at these achievements 1.67% 1.74 defeat the chainsaw Teddy's that was the Metal Gear section you had to make him ram in, into an outhouse and then while he's stuck in shit you beat the shit out of him the brewmaster retrieve Fajo the money Fajo I don't get it in the brewery, that's probably some kind of reference or joke. Italian plumber, retrieve Fajo the money in the brewery without taking damage. Oh wow, 0 0.09. Probably the rarest achievement I have on Xbox. <laughs> Amass fortune, collect enough money to pay off your bar tab, which was the main quest in episode 1. And save the cock and plucker from destruction, you had to piss on dynamite and finally on birdie on, fa on fire. And that's when you guys walked in, <laughs> unfortunately. So we can, but don't have to finish the side quests. I see it's kind of struggling. Like I said, it's it was never updated properly when, as the console kept get, getting updated, a lot of games would get patches, you know, to because the Xbox kind of runs on Windows 10. All right, man, you're going back to work. Yeah, how are you? How's How's the family, man? What's what's going on? I didn't ask you, and I should have. Tell me, tell me something. How are you guys? Is the is it improving? How's the how's the heir to the throne? Is he walking about now? I'm glad you're interested in the vod, though. People prefer live shit over recorded shit. Awesome! Give him hugs for me, man. All three of them. The launcher ammo? Sure, why not? I don't know what this is. Danger explosive. Oh. Ow! Okay, it did warn me. Wait, but I missed both side quests. Uh, there should be somewhere. Ah! I'm not gonna create anything there, so because I don't wanna over. You know what? Machine gun time. Where the fuck are you guys coming from? No, no grenades, please. Alright. The machine guns are pretty cool, actually. So he reloads as soon as you stop shooting. Cool. Ow! 
asshole. Assholes. Gonna help assholes. Thank you. The water is so fucking loud. But I don't have any. So the only... The only gag is the machine gun. Oh, fucking gas grenades, really? So the gas, gas mask guy. Oh, there we go. But I can't pick it up, why? Maybe I need this, no? Yeah, the, the, ooh, the, the bat is definitely better for groups. Can't take, I think because I have too many weapons. They do give me money, which I can use to level up the hero, conquer. So we're all the way to the end and I didn't find those two side quests. Look at that guy stuck in the... So let's not go there yet. I gotta find that alien ship. I've never seen that side quest. But where? There it is. Smoking hot. Love, are you seeing this? Sash? Are you seeing this? So, I finished the big reunion and I wanted to show off the like how Project Spark works. And like, I went to the crossroads mode and Conquer is a selectable hero and Teddies are selectable enemies. You can make your own Conquer game, which I just did, so I'm playing through it. I didn't expect that. Alright. A space person. There's a lot more con content than we had on Windows. So much more. Biomes, characters, all that shit. Make it better. Remix a world and in increase the rating minimum. 100 downloads or what? Or defeat one goblin in crossroads. Yep. Updated achievements. Hello, friend. I come in peace. Uh, hello, who are you? I am a traveler from the stars. My ship is ruined, but there is a Kodite crystal that crashed nearby. If I can find it, it will give me enough power to call for help. I don't know why they're robot, but I decided. I would be happy to help. It's kind of what I do. Fantastic. I will follow your lead. Where will you wander to find this? So let's, let's just for sake of simplicity put it right here. Whoosh! The fuck was that? All the coins. What is this for? Oh, to bring me back to the village. Cool. Oh, I love that. Teddies, wait, we gotta save the villagers. Where is that? Nope, not them. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cotton filled Teddy. <laughs> he is actually filled with cotton. Charge! So that's the ship. I came in for something short. And nostalgic, and I got something. <laughs> I like this more than the actual reunion. I wish Conker's voice was there, though. That's the only missing thing. Fuck the goblins! Oh, they also have a laser. Nice! There it is. The crystal. That's the biggest crystal I've ever seen. Uh, you obviously haven't played Final Fantasy, my man. I just need to ship to siphon off the codite energy and hey, what the... Oh, there's the mysterious figure. Who or what was that? I can't do Conker's voice. 
no idea I have never seen anything like that mm, there may still be enough residue left in the surrounding soil to power my distress beacon beep boop beep Ah, uh, you missed it, zombie. We finished Conker's big reunion. Hey, hello. So you, I finished Conker's big reunion, the actual sequel. It was very short because uh, it was canceled before it was like this whole concept of Project Spark was canceled before it was released. Before it would, it took off ground. It existed for like five or six months. But then, by I just wanted to show the people in stream. Uh, how because this is a game that's it's a game creation game you create a game and you can play it and you can share it with friends so i wanted to show off the uh the crossroads mode which is where you create and play at the same time you can test it which is what i'm doing and i had no idea there's conquer content in this as well i heard about it but it didn't occur to me so i just created my own conquer game this is what i just made this like the entire thing if you don't believe me believe me <laughs> I just made this game. It didn't exist up until this point. So yeah. Aha. It worked. My distress call is being answered. Farewell, friend. We must part. But I leave you with a gift. You're gonna give me something? Alright. Use weapon dispenser? Yes. What will your reward be? And now you can... So as you build, I'm building a game as I'm playing it. Big but a boomer. A gun with the power to stun. Stun gun. A ricochet blaster. Oh, that sounds nice. A big but a boomer. I like the big but a boomer. I'm gonna go with that. They'll respect your authority. Did you just quote Cartman? Only the beginning. Complete your first crossroads crossroad side quest. Hmm, can I change? No, it's already too late. So RB to un unequip, is that what they said? LB to unequip, okay. I'm back to my machine gun or bat. Alright, but I can switch. So only Conquer has this, like switchable weapons, as far as I know. Other heroes don't have this. Ooh, more coins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's your day at work, uh, zombie? Ooh, what's this? We can create something else. What does your hero discover here? What mystery is ready to be revealed? Hmm. A lupine adventure? A well used for wishing? A friend with shiny new weapons to share? A rock in a hard place? There are so many new ones I haven't Financial seen. Supporter? Mine exploration. A mystery treasure with a mystery code? I'm gonna go a gift of wealth. With deep pockets? Yes. It's not your fault people want to give you things. <laughs> hello. Well, hello. It's not every day I get to meet a giant squirrel, much less a talking one. Why would you help us? I could really use the cash. Your shifting eyes tell me you, you're looking for a lost thing or some sort. Am I right? I'm actively searching for the magic apple that the village in, is in dire need of. I need a keen sense of sight so as to not confuse it with any ordinary apple. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, zombie. Hope something fun hits you in the head, preferably not physically. Yes, pussy, you want to climb? Yeah, she wants to climb. Now settle down. Don't nest on me, just fucking lie down, please. Yes, pussy. Good pussy. Oh, she's in mood for petting. What the fuck? Look at her! Did you miss me? I believe you. She came to say hi, I suppose. Hello. I'm gonna keep you on my 
shoulder like a parrot. I'm gonna teach you to be on my shoulder. So you can be the assistant producer pussy. Listen, listen, I always wanted to help someone on a quest. Take this, it should be worth at least 20 coins. Good things come to those who are late, er, who wait. I love his Some humor. <laughs> I miss that, like, cheeky humor. A sack of coins? A gem? Mm, gem sounds nice, I want the gem. Shiny and valuable. If you can find the strength to break this gem, you'll receive riches. Wonderful, thanks. Goodbye for now. No, here. Can you do? Can you aim? No. There we go. Fucking beat the shit out of it. Oh, there we go. We got 20 coins. Nice. Brute force, kids. That's what we're doing. No, but I like hearing Kendo, as long as you're talking about the original and not the remake. I don't care what people think, I, uh, the remake is half-assed, and I'm pretty sure Zombie agrees with me. If you didn't include A and B scenarios, you didn't make a good Resident Evil 2 remake. I could get over the over-the-shoulder camera, the, the, the Brian Irons bullshit where he turns into a rabbit dog, all that shit. Yeah, my man, that's what I want to hear. It's the original. Well, good, man. I, I'm, I'm interested. I like you. I like watching you play those mods. Fuck you, fucking asshole. What are we gonna discover here? What new adventure awaits? <gasps> the Codian Beacon, right An away. Ancient Codian relic. Yes. What will it beckon? But what do I do with it? Yes, activate beacon. Wow, it's way more complete than on PC. Master, we finally found our Codium beacon. Master will be pleased. <laughs> Conquer stuck. Oh, wow, is it because of how I built the world? Is, that, is this it? Yeah, I think, so, it wasn't completely finished, and things like this can happen. If you build things wrong, you might not be able to finish it. We could edit the world and try to make it ourselves, but, damn it. Skip the cutscene. Is there anything to skip the cutscene? Nope. Well, we can wait for a while, see if it has a failsafe. But because that bridge is there, they can't... I think that's the reason, at least. And if it glitches, I'll at least show you the edit mode. That means I'll lose all the experience I got on this run. Which is okay. Honestly, I never expected Project Spark to work again. Like I said, it's unusable on PC, even if you had it, Microsoft has removed it from your account. Like, if I try to boot it on the PC, it says, you don't have Project Spark on your account. So I was really surprised to see it work on the console, but I'm not surprised by this, honestly. It, I had to find a way, it doesn't even work properly when you boot it, because... Entering editing edit mode will remove you from crossroads mode. You will not be able to resume your adventures from within crossroads mode, but you will be able to edit and play what you have created so far. Are you sure you would like to proceed? No, I don't want to proceed. I, just, I mean, I want to proceed with the main game. Damn it. Nope. Nothing we can do, I guess. So, uh... Okay. Now it's gonna save it as a game that we created and you can edit it. And now we entered the edit mode. We won't be able to finish the game because we didn't finish it. But we'll be able to do what we did so far. So you can see how things work. I can show you around a bit. Just as soon as I find, remember how to zoom. Yeah. Whoop, whoop. 
So we can add and edit objects, attach. We can uh, sculpt the terrain. Expand. How do I? How? What was the flip button? Just can't remember. LB. No, RB. Wait. I know there's a. Trying to remember the controls. Scale, shape, intensity. Uh, 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 uh. Undo, sculpt, camera menu, brush menu, move up, move down, change tool. So expand, there should be subtract. Ah, okay. Invert, invert sculpt is the opposite. So expand, subtract, add, remove, smooth or harden, plateau or tunnel. Cubify or decubify. So let's say we go expand. Make it bigger. And then you can do like whatever is there, you can make it bigger. <laughs> then um, there we go. Now we can see the others. The road, subtract, rough and tunnel. and decubify. So right now it's plateau. But you can also make a tunnel through things. Whoosh. Well, you should hold it a bit longer, but yeah. I always prefer the controller controls on this than the PC ones. Believe it or not, controller controls are a lot more smooth. It worked with touch, mouse and keyboard and controller because it was also on tablets, Microsoft tablets. Uh, I'm pretty sure, but you couldn't do this with touch and and mouse. You were fixed. The, this would always be stuck to the ground, and that sucked. So let's zoom out, take a look at our world. That's the whole world we've created so far in the crossroads mode. And here we go. We can see some logic here. That's what I wanted to show off. So here, here are the logic cubes, whatever they're called. I think I need to go to here Prop mode is how you add Prop interesting mode. objects and life to your world it's also where you go to edit or remove them now you'll really be bringing the world to life the prop palette below contains the most recently used items the arrow just above it takes you to the prop gallery thanks love. where just about anything can be found so now wow <laughs> This was the harder part for most people, but it's not as hard as it looks. Let's say this one. Uh, character Studio. Brain. So this is how the brain of everything works in Brain, in Project Spark. Global player not equal to nothing. And then, when something happens, do this. When something happens, do this. That's basically how you programmed. I'm not going to bore you with details now, like whoever's interested in this, I'm going to do a proper Project Spark stream in the future. But um, you basically could just like program, it was very versatile, I loved how this worked. And what was it, start, brain gallery, you had brain gallery, you could add like pre-made uh, brains to the game, very sexy. Equip item, this is what the difficulty of there. Enemy scavenger brain, door to another world, dragon enemy. But you could also create it manually. So, ooh, four pages of brain, Jesus Christ. When player position, th here's a good example. When player position, player position, X is less than minus 160, so I guess closer than 160 pixels to the object. Switch page, player return, return player to home. Let's check the brain of the, of the teleporter. Where was the teleporter? You can imagine like uh, a person like me just going wild with this. I fucking skipped work to play Project Spark, I'll be honest. Uh, brain. 
So let's do, see the brain of the teleporter. Pain terrain, blah 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 blah. One player equal to nothing and global player not equal nothing. Player equals global player. Wow, I don't even know what this means in the syntax, but okay. Do teleportation, teleporting text equals player above. Okay. When this player instructions, when no longer detect player, this player instructions equals false. When detect player and not player uh, NIS active, do player say this is the town's teleporter. So you can make the text, you could customize everything. Player teleported from road. <laughs> uh, and it was really cool to get someone's creation because some people aced this. Some people remade whole games that we played as kids in Project Spark. Too bad I don't have any downloaded. I didn't have an Xbox when they shut it down. So I never got those games on my console. Only on the PC. So I would open someone's creation like this and just went through um, went through and see like what they did and get ideas for my own creations. Which are all dead, unfortunately. But yeah, this is uh, that's that's Conquer's reunion and Project Spark in a nutshell. We can like test world properties. You can change the sky. Visual filter desaturated, saturated, antique, black and white, all cool. Let's say antique, sun brightness, sun side position, like everything. You could put uh, your own music. Tags. So you could see like, let's say music, their music. Loop. Is there like actual music? I'm pretty sure there should be. Back, uh, remove tag. So yeah, you can imagine I fucked around with this so much. And had I, if I had Conquer back then on the PC, oh, we would have more Conquer reunions. Trust me. But this is the this is the furthest we've gotten in terms of Conquer's big reunion. So yeah, let's exit. Exit without saving. I don't want to save this. Too bad it didn't save anything from the crossroads. Up. Oh. Vote collector or play two minutes of community games, but there are no community games, so yeah, that was Conquer's big reunion, ladies and gentlemen, along with uh, my own Conquer created game that fortunately crashed. Uh, like I said, we'll do a proper Project Spark, like Project Spark stream, where we'll fuck around with Project Spark. Maybe even check around if somebody else has it, has it because you can create in multiplayer and co op, it's just wild. and. Um, Let's see who we can raid. I gotta go eat something and rest a bit. Then see where we're gonna stream. Uh, it should have been Outbreak File 2, but since zombies at work, I'm uh, all up for leaving that for tomorrow when both Zombie and Mammon are gonna be here. And uh, well, it's it's a lot easier when people are home than, you know, Zombie disappearing mid-work or his internet fucking up worse than mine, stuff like that. Let's see. I have this idea I wanna raid Shakshi Weshki. Which is, I think, is what we're gonna do. Oh yeah, let's. Why is Wesker always twice in there? <laughs> let's raid Sexy Wesky. He's playing Resident Evil Director Scott. Fuck yeah, man! Like not really connected to this, but we owe it to, to Wesky. We do owe it to Professor Weska. So uh, enjoy Sexy Wesky. I should be back in an hour with Sun Hill uh, Downpour. I'm gonna say is gonna be next. 
Uh, in the meantime, enjoy Westkey and I'll see you all in the next stream. Bye for now. Thanks everyone who's watching.